Oh my god, yes, okay, that's how we're starting off the video. We're doing realistic skateboarding tricks part three? Part four? Realistic skateboarding tricks only part whatever. We're getting better. Every single one of these I film, we get better. That felt pretty good. I'm slowly getting better at the filming too. Got that low fish eye angle, nollie heel nose slide. Nice lock in to nollie shove, croak or nose grind to 180 out the hard way. Oh, that was good. Complimenting myself on my own trick. Oh, I love that. What's going on, guys? Welcome to another Skater XL video. It's been a while. It actually hasn't really been that long at all. It's been, what, one video, two videos? Lately, I've been doing a lot of shenanigans in Skater XL. I've been doing, I did, like, the world's longest rail. I did, oh my god, I didn't see that bench there. I've been having fun, which is good, obviously. That's kind of the point of it. But uh, I haven't really been doing that much realistic stuff. And while having fun is fun and everything, sometimes playing realistic Skater XL is just my favorite thing to do. Do, and I'm not very good at it right now. I'm just bumping into things. We're at this school, which is arguably my favorite map at the moment. It's what when one would what, what, what 116 high school. That is where we are. It's like a replica of a bunch of different LA spots all combined to one high school. It's like a dream spot in real life. I did a little tour or skate around, whatever you want to call it, when I first downloaded the map and titled it something along the lines of like my new favorite map or I don't know something YouTube-y. I didn't really have like a, a session on anything I just kind of more skated around um, so I thought it could be fun to go to a couple different maps and skate or try to. Milo you were growling at a mailman outside yeah it's okay I'm not. When I first started this realistic skate series, or I don't know, whatever you want to call it, uh, I started out doing famous, like, real spot only, like replicas of Hollywood High and whatnot. It has then since transformed into skating kind of... Uh, skating any map as long as, you know, the tricks are possible. Not for me, but just in general. Oh, that flips so slow. Get a lot of requests for my stats menu, my XXL mod 2.0 stats settings, so here they are. This is just kind of like what I found looks and feels the best for me. I know a lot of people have different settings. You guys want to see them. Here they are. I've showed them a couple times before, but the realistic skating, they go hand in hand with these settings for me personally. I am still doing the realistic manual catch. And for those of you that don't know what that is, pretty much every, whoops, every trick that I do, I have to manually, like, what the, 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 the what is going on with my mouth and my speech and my vocal cords? When I push down these sticks, uh, I have to sneeze, god damn it. Hey, two. I Shit you not. The sun is setting. You can see the, the sun setting out there this whole day. It is uh, hey, It is 7 47 p.m. The entire day today, I have not once sneezed or had allergies, and I just started filming and my allergies are acting up. This happens in every single video. I'm allergic to you guys not thumbs upping the videos. If I go to flip a trick and I don't catch it, it just keeps spinning. Same with spinning and flipping. I have to manually catch it or else that happens. If you watch the overlay and I do a flip, catch with my back foot or front foot oops front foot or both so that's that's that i get a lot of people asking if i'm playing on manual catch still and i am i think it makes the game a lot more fun in my opinion wow that was sketchy and then nollie red heel nope i forget what school these rails are at in real life but i'm trying to think i'm th i'm picturing shane o'neill doing like a nollie tray front board on this right now so we're gonna fulfill my wildest dreams and eat shit there it was, that was it. I tried to learn this trick for the longest time and it literally seems impossible to me. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, that wasn't bad. The keyframing could use some work, but hey, it's better than I used to be. Ooh, aw, my trucks match the rail, I forgot. One of my biggest problems with tray flip lips or tray flip boards is I usually over rotate them and then like glitch them into the boards so that doesn't look very good. So I tried to do it how you would in real life where you just under rotate the tray flip. And I'd say it works pretty good. I don't want to skate the parts of this that I skated in the last video, so I'm trying to branch out a little bit here. I tried to skate this thing. I didn't do a very good job. Whoa, whoa, ow. I slid so far. All right, back tail, big flip. So we get in, push the trigger. Oh, I got to flick it faster. On the topic of that, something I get asked a lot is how I was doing these combo tricks. Like if I go into something... Okay, that's a terrible example. These are really short, but it'll do the trick. Pop in, pop out. You see what I mean? Like those combo things, people couldn't understand how I was doing those. And yes, it's a mod at the same time that it isn't a mod. In my XXL mod, you go to miscellaneous and it is... 
pop out right here. So this, if you have the the dog the dog Vinci, the XXL mod by Dog Vinci, and you select this, it changes the straight pop out to default. It, you can read it instead of popping out automatically to one of the sides, it pops you up. So that's how you can do the combo tricks. If you don't have that mod, what you can do is. Once you're in the grind, push both triggers and then you'll pop straight up instead of out. I guess some of you didn't know that the triggers control your pop out. So you're in a grind and you push the left trigger. Well, that's a terrible example too. If you're in the grind, left trigger, you pop out to that side. If you're in the grind, right trigger, you pop out to that side. You're in the grind, push both triggers, you pop straight up. That's how you can do the, the combo tricks without that mod that I have installed. The reason I bring that up is because when you're in the back tail, I have to push that left trigger in order for it to pop out, otherwise I would have popped straight up. I always make my camera out of focus somehow. I don't even know how I can make a video game camera out of focus. I don't really know how to long lens film in this game, because I mean, usually I would just do like some sort of panning shot. Let's see if that works. Come from behind the bush, back tail. That wasn't bad. I landed in the bank. Kind of thought I was going to pop to flat, but that actually not worked better than I thought. We'll get a couple more tricks here. Ooh, let's try just the, the wall rail. The scariest thing in skateboarding for me. You get in. Um, yeah. Whoa, that's crazy. It looks like my, my head is on that poster and I'm skating the wall, except it's just not because I'm on this side of it. Oh, same thing here, except backwards. That's why wall rails, wall rail, that's hard to say. That's why wall, wall, that is why wall rails <laughs> scare me. Cause I'm always afraid I'm gonna smack my face against the wall or fall and get my legs stuck in between the, the wall and the rail. Da -da, da -da, da -da, da -da, da -da, kind of, my head's literally gone. Yeah, that popped out. We'll take it. I never skate quarter pipes. Let's try to get a clip on this. I want to get like back nose but fakey would be sick. I popped it way too high and then I died. It slid down. What about just like a front blunt? That could work. Mm, it's popping out too far. Yeah. All right, let's go to a different map. Oh, by the way, they have this map in a night mode that looks really cool. If I were better at filming, I would use the, the night maps in my edits because they look cooler and they're more artsy because you can put a camera light on your camera in the game. It's very realistic. <whistles> oh, God damn it. I always forget. I get it all queued up and then I forget to do it. The top comment on the last video was to play Evan Smith's piece part. So I had it all queued up and ready to go and I never, I never pushed play. I apologize. Oh, why is the map blue? You guys know, or if you don't know, uh, what are the top comment is on my videos is what gets played on the TV behind me, except it has to be uh, appropriate, because if I had a dollar for every time someone asked me to play porn, I would be a rich man. So what, the, the day version of the map works, but the night version, that has to be off? No, I guess it, guess it just doesn't work. Oh no, it's frozen. No! Oh god! Oh, we'll try this map. I'm very bad at skating transition in real life and in the game, but we're gonna try it. This is a beta map. When the, the new update came out with transition skating, someone put this out so there's no surroundings of the map, but it's a really good looking bowl. Pump around here. Mm-hmm. Picking up speed, picking up way too much speed. How about just a rock and roll? A rock and roll grind. And we'll call it a day. There it is. There's my bowl clip for this video. <laughs> Moving on. Oh god. This map is so big, it's making my computer lag. Oh, we have skated here. This is the Cybertruck map, and we're dropping frames. Okay, different map. What is going on with these maps? Whoa, I feel like I'm on fucking drugs. Not that I'd know. Oh, I don't like this. It's making me all motion sick. I don't even have tray flips. I don't know what it is about this map, but I really like it too. Um, how about like a nolly heel lip? Oh. Ow. Oh, I'm sitting so- uh, Ah! I'm alive! Repair the board. Now I got the fresh board. And too fresh, obviously. Boom. Oh yeah, that's quick. I'm trying to work on switch skating in the game too. Let's try to switch flip front board. Oh, I should not have popped out of that. Why do I make sounds when I skate? Boom, boom. And why does it help? There it is. I think that was it. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's so quick. And then, oh, that's okay. Let's piece, oops, ow. Let's piece a line together. Switch lip on the, down the kink here. And then, oh God, oh God. I guess something like that would be more realistic if I just did a 50-50 on this because that'd be pretty gnarly. Oops. Oh, that was a good one, come on. Yes, and then back three. 
No! Oh, I don't care about that one. Switch. Oh, was that not a switch lip? Damn it. I really thought that was a switch lip. That was a switch wheel grind. Redo. That was the switch lip. Now the 50 50 pop out, and now I can get the back three. I did the same thing! Switch lip was pretty much perfect. That looked real. Bing, bing, bing. Okay, and then. Whoa. I popped a little bit high for that, but that's fine. Uh, pop out was kind of whack looking. It looks like my feet are glued to my board. Damn, that's some good, some good lock though. That heel side lock in, and then magically pull out. Arlington High School was it? I turned off the map fix mod, so it might work this time. Ooh, it worked. And the trees look like spaceships. My favorite spots in real life are these little handicap rails. And I, I choked on my throat. My hair looks white. My biggest thing for crooks in this game is I really try to get pinch in them. Those front trucks, yeah. Look at that. Oh, that is, that is good. Good job, Skater XL. I, I like that. Oh, I want to learn that trick. And then, after a, a crook nolly flip, maybe backsmith. Uh, backsmith tray would be insane. Interesting. I need to wax it, bro. Where's the wax at? Seriously. <laughs> Maybe just wall 50-50 this one instead. And then I hit an invisible wall. So big spin. Switch back 180 and hit the car. Let's do one more map for this realistic skate video. Oh, these loading screens take so long. Now you see me. No, you don't. This map's cool. It has a lot of rails and gaps and stuff. Quick backsmith. Why? I can't backsmith today. Nolly flip backsmith. That's a trick I don't do. For a good reason, apparently. Dude, what happens at the end there? It starts out so good. Every time I get a good lock and I just hit... Oh. It's because my board's literally going through the rail. And then it glitches out. Damn it. All right. That might be as good as we're going to get. If I dip it, that weird glitch happens. Mm, that wasn't that good. Like I said, some rails just don't want to be grinded. Oh, wait. I see line potential. Let's just get back lip. And then a little ollie up. And then front big spin over the rail. Or that. Not trying that. Yeah, well, that, that works. Oh god, I almost hit the pole. Phew. All right, I've been filming. Oh god, I've been filming for like an hour. Should probably end this off. Bring it in. Yes. Counts. All right, well, I, I forgot how much I enjoyed making these realistic videos. They're, sometimes it's fun to just fuck around and do whatever, but realistic, like that's what this game is for in my opinion. I think it does a really good job of the physics. Oh, whoa, I've never been over here. Oh, that was sick. If you enjoyed the video, please drop a thumbs up. It really helps me out and it's free. So you can help from the pleasure of your own home. I know you're on your phone right now. Click that thumbs up button. Do it now or else. I'll see you guys tomorrow for the new video. I'm thinking about doing another Skate 3 video because it's been a while. So uh, give me some stuff to do. See you tomorrow, guys. Peace out. Can't stop till I got a quarter million on the wrist.